Hey guys, welcome back to Just the Board again. Today, as you can tell, I'm going to be changing out this drain cover. It is disgusting. The water barely goes down it. Uh, it literally is just a cover that got all this grime and gunk on it that it's just collected. So I'm just going to show you how simple it is and it's really about a 12 second job, 10 second job, somewhere in there. So let's get into it. So all you're going to really need is a flathead screwdriver. I'm going to show you on the new cover. See how it has these little, not tabs, but indentations. All you gotta do is put your screwdriver in there, plop it up. Now, you can also slide it in here, pop it up. It's up to you, but that's what these are for. So, I'll take it out, and then I'll show you how you just snap these in. So as you can see there, looks like it focused. You just gotta make sure these snap in, and that's what holds it in place. Just push down, put it in how you take it out. So just look what where these indentations are, copy it, put it in, and you're done. So let me show you. Hopefully my big fat head doesn't cover the camera. There you go. Clean out the drain while you're in here. Super, super disgusting, but it needs to be done. It's gonna get even grosser. I'm gonna have to get in there with their hand. Make sure you wear gloves for the obvious reasons. As you can see, you definitely wanna wear gloves for this. But try to get in there as best as you can. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and finish cleaning this up, pick it up, and then I'll show you how to put it in. So now you can see I cleaned fairly well for the most part. I do need to get a good bleaching and scrubbing in here, but uh, the hole's clean. I made sure we got good drain, we got good water flow going out. So now all that's left is to install this. So remember how I said this little groove indentation, whatever you wanna call it, to line them up just like you had before, that way it slides on easier. So here goes. And there you have it, it's in. It won't wiggle or anything, it just snaps in with those four little prongs that it has. And that's all there is to it. It's really quick to remove, really quickly, to, or real quick to replace. Just a pain in the butt to clean, as you saw, especially if you haven't cleaned your drains and stuff in a while. So I try to keep it maintained. Like I said, I hadn't done mine in a while. I try to recommend it every year, but I obviously failed at it. It kind of just skips your mind after a while, but you know what you gotta do. Take care of your homes as best as you can. So we'll catch you next time when we're just aboard again, making another video. Later.